This is your weekly moment of growth. I am currently in Orlando, Florida, by way of Tampa and Clearwater for The Thing Live, uh, which obviously, as you guys know, a year ago, I was one of the keynote speakers here at this event, and I am back uh, with my good friend Terry Weaver and Mike Kim and all these other incredible people uh, you know, sharing the stage and sharing our love and wisdom from one another. It's really made me think, and it's something that I've talked about on this podcast before, just the power of connection. And the power of being able to connect with people who are like-minded, who are big thinkers, who can give you the little tips and tricks along the way that will get you to where you want to go. So what are you doing this year to ensure that for yourself? Because as we sit in our hometowns and we connect with the same people over and over again, we're not feeding our soul. We're not feeding our passion and our drive. You have to be able to break out and connect with people that you've never connected with before. That's how you grow. That's how you build your circle. And here at The Thing, obviously, the speakers and the attendees get to connect and mingle and grow together. And obviously, you know, when we talk about my event as well, Growth Now Movement Live, which is happening in just two weeks from today, which is absolutely insane and scary all at once, you know, it creates that opportunity to be able to push out of your comfort zone, to learn things you've never learned before, to shift your perspective, to really put you in a position to grow. So I want you guys to sit down and map out your next calendar year, and I want you to decide what events you're going to go to, to connect, to learn, to grow. That could be in your backyard. That could be in a different town. That could be in a different country. I know people that are going to events in Bali and Puerto Rico and all these amazing places, but pick three to four of them between now and this time next year that are going to serve you, that are going to lift you, that are going to let you level up in all areas. Because as I sit in this room with these amazing people, that's both, by the way, that's both the attendees and the speakers. I don't ever want to put myself or other speakers on pedestals. We are going through the same thing that you guys are going through. We just might be a couple steps ahead, and that's why we're on the stage. And so when I started to attend events and started to learn and mimic and mirror, I was able to put myself in the right positions to then become a speaker. So if that's a goal of yours, pay attention to the speakers, connect with them, ask them the right questions. Live events are the key to ultimate growth. So go challenge yourself this year. Go to three, four, five, six events, but learn something every time and make a connection every time. Do not become an event hopper and live off the high that does nothing for you. What you need to do is connect, learn, and grow. I'm down here in Orlando, Florida, having a blast for a couple more days. I hope you guys are enjoying your life right now as well, too. I'll see you next week.